Now is a dynamic time to be working in the field of microbiology and specifically microbial genomics. One key reason is the rapidly growing understanding of our own microbiota, the community of microscopic organisms that lives on and in us, and the microbiome, the genomes of these organisms. And next generation sequencing, NGS, is the core technology for metagenomics, the study of genomic samples from a defined community. NGS technology is so powerful, it's playing a key role in community sampling efforts around the world. Illumina is the leading innovator of NGS technology and services. Illumina's NGS technology is central to many projects and studies, including the American Gut Project, an ongoing crowdsourced venture that gives ordinary people the opportunity to examine their own microbiota. So about two years ago, uh, Rob Knight down at University of Colorado Boulder and uh, Jeff Leach and myself came together and we, we had a, um, a problem. We wanted to do a survey of the microbiome, the bacterial communities that live in and on people, um, from thousands of people literally thousands. The American Gut Study is a citizen science project which helps people from around America to have access to the expertise and, and scientific capability to understand what bacteria and microorganisms live in and on their body. So it's a, it's a project aimed at uncovering the microbiome of Americans but also international participants. So the American Gut Study has several main goals. The first primarily is to build a knowledge base of information which helps us to uncover the relationships between lifestyle, diets, disease and the bacterial communities which live in our body. We're looking for correlations between those conditions. So there are many factors that affect the microbiome in individuals such as lifestyle, um, this can be how many times you go out walking, diet, what kinds of foods you eat, interactions with different people, how much water you drink during the day, the differences in the factors that should influence your home, how much do you clean, do you have pets or not. The larger our database of participants, the more statistical power we have to evaluate how the microbiome um, responds to different conditions. So when the participants um, have, have send back their sample, we, it comes back to our lab, we extract the DNA from that sample. The sample can be a, some stool or it can be a nasal swab, an oral swab. People are even doing their dogs and cats. But when, when we extract that DNA, we then process it. So we, we analyze the, the microbiome by sequencing using, using Illumina technology. We sequence the, the genes of the bacteria that live in that sample. So what currently people are getting is an understanding of the, the species of bacteria or, or the taxonomic groups of bacteria that live inside their bodies. How, that, how that's similar to other people in around America. Now, the researchers of the American Gut Project are using Illumina's MySeq system to sequence the 16S ribosomal RNA gene. This is a powerful method for characterizing many different bacteria in every sample they receive. Highly complex bacterial communities are commonly identified using 16S ribosomal RNA sequencing. The 16S rRNA gene codes for part of the ribosome found in bacterial cells. Sections of this gene are conserved across the genomes of all bacteria species. But variations within the coding sequence are used to tell different species apart, and even how they're related to each other. 16S ribosomal sequencing is a powerful method for characterizing many different bacteria in a sample. Before next-generation sequencing, this technique was much more limited. With capillary electrophoresis sequencing, each type of bacteria had to be grown as a pure culture, and its genomic DNA sequenced one organism at a time. With next-generation sequencing, many microbial organisms from a complex sample, such as the gut, can be identified simultaneously using the 16S method without the need for colony isolation or culture. Simply swab, perform sample prep, and sequence on MySeq to get a comprehensive picture of what organisms are in your gut. And Illumina's MySeq is becoming the world's platform of choice for next-generation sequencing. Analyzing MySeq data is simple. The built-in MySeq reporter software includes a range of analysis pipelines, including a 16S metagenomics analysis tool. This 16S analysis tool is also available on BaseSpace, Illumina's cloud computing environment. 
Alternatively, the data can be exported into third-party software. The streamlined experimental workflow and intuitive user interface allow any lab to quickly become proficient in the simple steps of 16S sequencing with MySeq. Step 1. Order Amplicon primers based on your region of interest. Step 2. Using standard laboratory techniques, generate Amplicon libraries by PCR. Then add Illuminous sequencing and index adapters. Step 3. Sequence on MySeq. Step 4. Analyze the results using the 16S metagenomics on the onboard MySeq reporter software or on BaseSpace. Next generation sequencing is what makes the American Gut Project possible. What's, what's uh, striking about projects like the American Gut Study um, and other studies that we run is that they've only just become possible. Even five years ago this would have been extraordinary. The rapid evolution of, of sequencing technology especially has enabled us to get much more data much quicker for well, a lot less money. A lot less money. Orders of magnitude less and, and that's been foundational in the, in the potential of these studies. It wouldn't have been possible without it. With its ease of use, speed, and ability to generate more data of higher quality, the MySeq Benchtop Sequencer is the first choice for labs around the world and for initiatives such as the American Gut Project. Thanks to Illumina's NGS technology and the important studies it enables, we can continue to understand the role of the microbiome in the health and wellness of all people worldwide.